you know that kind of frustration where you have a skill but you can only do it for other people and you can't do it on yourself that is how i'm feeling right now pardon my voice by the way i have a little cold so i don't sound like my usual self apparently i cannot retie my own locks on my own head how sad is that <laughs> oh my god it's so frustrating it's been what over a year now i'm almost a year and a half now into locks and i still have not found a way to retie my own locks it's so frustrating. I'm, I'm frustrated. And now I'm regretting getting tiny locks because if your locks are tiny, you spend a lot more time trying to retie, you know. And it's expensive. It's very expensive having to pay people to get your locks done every four to six weeks. I mean, and I got locks for freedom. I got it because I wanted to control how my hair looks, how it feels. I wanted to do my hair when I wanted, how I wanted it. You know, I didn't want somebody telling me how my hair should look like. I didn't want people um, relocking my hair, pulling my hair how they want. You know, and when I complain, they start to act weird and all that i just didn't want it right so like i wanted to do stuff by my own accord so you know you can choose to interlock just do two loops and you're okay you don't want it to be too tight you know all of that that's the kind of freedom i felt like i needed if i had locks but then i get locks and realize i can't do this can you imagine so um another reason why i'm ranting like this is because imagine i'm unable to meet my loctician let's say they are unavailable or i can't get a good loctician you know there are several locticians around but it's not all of them that are like very good or patient to do your hair especially if you have tiny locks like mine you've seen how tiny my locks are right so now Let's say they are not available. What do you do then? Okay, so then it's so handy if you can do your own thing so that whenever they are not available or something, you can do your thing by yourself. Especially if you know how to do it. I have this skill and I cannot use it. It's, oh, I'm so frustrated. <laughs> I need this runs. I need to run. I'm so frustrated. And I just want to retire yesterday. <laughs> um but uh, my previous one before yesterday's retire um uh, was on the 9th of june that's almost eight weeks ago of course unavailability of a loctician obviously now imagine i could do my own thing i only have to wait eight weeks <sighs> And about that, by the way, so I met this loctician that was doing my hair fine, right, from late last year till now. I mean, until that 9th or 8th June this year. But then, the relationship, the business relationship I had with that loctician kind of started changing. The person wanted something else in addition to what we already had, which was do my hair, I pay you, and we are done. That was the kind of relationship we had. But it looked like he wanted more than that, and I wasn't willing to offer that because um, anytime you start something off with business and you start to mix it with pleasure, it tends to backfire so most times i just like to keep business business and keep pleasure as pleasure especially when i know this relationship started off as business it's different if um 
we're friends already, we know, we've known each other already. I mean, those are different circumstances and these are obviously um, my gray area stories, right? I mean, you can meet your location and fall in love and then hit it off, I mean, it's okay. But I wasn't interested in that. And because of that, everything just um, got destroyed. Our business relationship got destroyed. And you see, this is a typical example of having to rely on people and then they disappointing you and you can't do your own retire. This is too sad. The guy started giving me excuses, I started getting off vibes. I mean, even before my last 8th June or 9th June retire, I started getting some signs that it was going to end some way, somehow, just because I didn't want what he wanted from me. But obviously, I cannot give what I don't have. It's just quite unfortunate, but it is what it is. So then back to what I'm saying, because of that, it took me so long to have to retire my hair because when it was time for my next appointment after that 9th June, I mean, it got to about um, five weeks. On my fifth week after the retire, I was ready for a retire and then I texted him, you know, excuses, either it's not available. I mean, you could tell that this person is trying to avoid you. But then there's no other person available to do it for me because of my location as of that time. <laughs> this is too frustrating. It is. I waited sixth week, still unavailable. Seventh week, then I had to move from Cape Coast to Accra to get this current retired done yesterday, which is 3rd August. 2024 so that's almost eight weeks of no retire guess what happened to my hair one of my locks actually undid or unraveled completely you would think that for locks that have almost matured my locks have matured haven't they and the second one had unraveled to about 50 percent then the rest had grown obviously had new growth underneath all of them and I was still not able to retie my own hair and I was unable to get a optician to do my hair and the optician I knew who could do the hair wanted something more than what we had and things got complicated and I was getting more frustrated at a point I tried doing it I tried I did I started from the back I couldn't Anytime I put the loop in, it just came off. I know how to do the interlocking using a, a bobby pin. Actually, can do it on somebody's head very fast. But doing it on my head, uh, uh it's a different thing altogether. I have a crochet pin that I can use to reload. I have it. I have two crochet pins in my room that I have several bobby pins, of course. I tried all of them and never worked. Then I found another maneuver, which I tried. I knotted my locks, unfortunately. The mistake was at the front. This is a fresh retire. My scalp is quite tender, but I'll still show you. Let me see if I can show you where it's okay. This here. Okay, there's no there's no hair there. I had to cut them. Okay, one of them actually came off. There are two. There's supposed to be two here. One of them just came off by itself. Then the other one, I had to cut it. This one. There's supposed to be one here. Here. I had to cut it from the base because I tried relocking it and then I messed it up. This is why I said I cannot retie my own hair. It's so sad. <laughs> After all my skills, after all my, oh, well, I know how to do hair, I can do hair, oh, at least I can lock my own hair. I installed my own locks. When people look at me, they're like, wow, I like your hair. Why did you get it done? I'm like, oh, I installed it myself. They're like, whoa, you can do hair, that's so nice. And you cannot interlock your own hair? Oh, shakpapa, that's what girls will tell you. Shakpapa, shakpapa.
so yeah i'll try and hide it for now um i tried to send the hair that i cut to the lotician from yesterday and she said i have to wait for them to grow up a bit so that's what i'm waiting for now while i hide it um i think i also lost um two more locks but that was because i had taken so long that um the new growth had become so thin they had matted on each other and the old lock was just pulling on the base so we had to join some locks i have less locks now um, i really hope that i can learn how to retie my own looks i can't believe this i can braid my hair i can twist my own hair i can curl my own hair but i can't interlock my own hair make it make sense why can't i do it and now i'm quite afraid because if i keep trying it and i keep losing the looks that's not good that's not good at all Please help me if, if, if you have a solution, I would appreciate it. End of my rant. <laughs>